The CQ can record all input channels to an SD card individually, to capture a live event and mix it down later for example, or to use for virtual soundcheck. Ensure you are using a supported SD card by checking that the card is SDHC, up to 32GB in size, Class 10 and UHS-1. This specification matches the hardware used in the CQ. Results with other cards, including those with higher speed ratings, will vary. Before recording, format the card from the Home screen, System, USB SD tab. Now go to the Config screen and in the USB SD Bluetooth tab select USB SD. At the bottom left of the screen select the source point. This is where the signal will be recorded from each input channel. For example, if you select Post Preamp then the recording will not include any of the channel processing, but if you select Post EQ the recording will include a high pass filter, gate, any inserted effects and the EQ as well. The source points are listed in order, so to record a channel with all of its processing, select Post AMM. For virtual sound check, ensure that you set the source to Post Preamp, so the audio that's played back into each channel is the same as the live source would be, and you're not trying to process a signal that's already been processed once before. Now select a sample rate. 96 kHz is higher quality and creates larger files when recording. 48 kHz is lower quality but creates smaller files, and with the CQ18T and CQ20B allows more than 16 tracks to be recorded at once. Then, if required, on the right of the screen, select the stereo signals you want to send out to the last three or four pairs of channels. By default, these include stereo inputs and the main LR output. Next, go to the Home screen and under the Record tab, select Multitrack. Arm any channels that you want to record by touching the button below each meter. This will have a grey circle when not armed, solid red when armed, and a red exclamation mark to show that the channel is armed but will not record, which can happen if the card is too slow, or if you have more than 16 channels armed when recording at 96kHz. When you are ready to record, just press the record button. The CQ will create the folder and files required, and then begin writing audio. At the end of the recording, press stop and wait for the recording to be finalised before turning off the mixer or removing the card. If you connect the card to a computer, you can see that each recording is stored in a new folder that contains individual WAV files which can then be copied from the card and imported directly into a DAW to mix and produce.